MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news via video media. Florian, SW Machine Tools are a world leader at multi-spindle milling machines. Can you tell me why this is, please? Uh, it's just to do with uh, twin spindle machining or in principle multi-spindle machining. Uh, means uh, higher production productivity, um, less investment uh, per square meter and as well uh, the benefit for the customer with a lower footprint and a higher productivity. So essentially you're getting two parts instead of one for the same process? Yes, exactly. That's what we are doing. And what's the machine behind us? That's our W08 machine, um, our biggest machine. Uh, spindle distance of 800 millimeter, table size 1.6 meters, and uh, mainly machining uh, automotive parts or like uh, shock towers uh, and as well aerospace parts uh, like uh, uh, turbine blades, uh, holders for cabinets and stuff. Mm -hmm. So you say 800 centers, so we can get a component, in fact two components that are 800 millimeters cubed. Absolutely right. On such a small footprint, that, that, that's very ergonomic. Oh yes, it is. Um, as you can see, uh, purely from uh, size of the machine, uh, we need. Uh, uh, you can load it uh, manually as well with an operator. It's no problem. I find it fascinating. Can we get into the technical data of the machine, the build quality? Uh, it's a linear motor machine. Uh, means uh, uh, high dynamics. Um, it's uh, uh, instead of a ball screw. Um, the, fixture and uh, as well the uh, rotary unions are all directly driven. Um, the tool magazine can be extended up to two times uh, 72 tools, so in 144 tools in total. Um, the machine weights about uh, 22 tons, uh, so there's quite a, a mass. Uh, we're moving around uh, with the twin spindle uh, um, separate independent sets are about one and a half tons. And can you explain for the viewers at home the difference between your rotary table and the competition? Um, the difference to the competition uh, is especially the multi-spindle as I already said before and uh, the rotary um, direct driven uh, high dynamics so that's uh, in principle the unique selling point for this machine. Can you talk us through the Q-axis and what makes that different to the competition? Yeah, uh, talking about the Q-axis, this is the pallet changer. Mm -hmm. uh, the pallet changer at this W is uh, not on the base of the machine, it's right and left center of the machine. Means uh, we're changing the pallets uh, mm -hmm. vertically, uh, not horizontally. And um, this enables us to uh, introduce, uh, to First of all, manually load the part outside uh, the work area and as well um, it has the advantage of uh, less dust inside uh, uh, the uh, rotary unit. Um, the uh, serviceability from the side of the machine is much better and these are the advantages. Mm. Yeah, another big one. This is a linear machine, so we're looking at magnesiums and aluminiums, presumably. Um, you can produce chips, which get which get stuck in holes, stuck in stuck in pockets, and that can and that can be sacrificial to your tool life. But I guess we're getting the best possible machining conditions when the components pretty much upside down. Exactly. Um, the components are mostly machined upside down or just, just perpendicular to the spindle means that uh, we've got a free chip fall to the chip conveyor uh, which uh, definitely helps us to get the machine cleaner than our competitors. All right, we are in front of a pre-assembled machine. What you can see here is uh, our Q-axis uh, that we are in outside the machine where we can load the parts this part with 180 degrees to inside the machine uh, where the parts are machined. So we're stood in front of a twin spindle setup here, aren't we? Yes, we are. This is exactly showing the box and box system. Uh, it's a twin spindle independent set. Uh, the X axis and the Y axis assembled to the back of the ram. There are several customized options available on the machine. 
Uh, as example, on the control side, we uh, manufacture the machine with a Siemens control, uh, Fanuc control or Bosch MTX as well, uh, which enables us to focus on uh, most customers all around the world. Um, there are uh, other options uh, like a complete turnkeys uh, we are doing, uh, including fixture design, fixture manufacturing. Uh, tools uh, are provided from big tool suppliers all around the world. Uh, we do a run off the machine, measure the parts, and then finally get the pre-acceptance done in-house and the final acceptance done at customer side. And I know SW going through unprecedented growth. You know, who's buying these machines? Um, they are bought from several customers around the world, automotive sector as well as aerospace sector, like already said. Um, we machine uh, like shock towers, uh, like uh, ABS valve housings, from smaller components uh, done on our small W02 or 222 machine, uh, up to the big ones W08 with the 800 millimeter spindle distance.